here. I'm Colleen Taylor. You're watching TechCrunch TV. I'm in Las Vegas, Nevada at the Consumer Electronics Show. And sitting with me is John Stein, who's the founder of Betterment, a goal-focused investing web app. That's right. So Betterment is the best way to save for your goals. It's goal-based investing. Now you are a longtime sort of friend of TechCrunch. We've reported on Betterment for a couple years now. You guys launched back in 2010. That's right. The first TechCrunch Disrupt, the one in New York City. Uh, we launched there. We won the, the best start, but startup in New York at that show. And just recently, you guys uh, awarded us the best uh, way to save for the new year, which was really nice. So I have to ask you though, I mean, this is a this is a web app, this is not a gadget. What are you doing here in Vegas? Are you just trying to tell everybody that they shouldn't be spending money no, <laughs> at the casino? <laughs> That's part of it, right? We've, uh, we've, we've done outings. We did an outing in Atlantic City just to teach the lesson of not gambling more, more than anything. But we, uh, uh, we're here because I think, uh, I think there's actually a lot of startups here, uh, web apps and, and interesting software companies this year. Not so much on the main exhibit floor, but in the periphery, you see a lot of them. And I think that's kind of a trend at the CES, is there's, there's more and more of that, because software is more and more important. Um, you see it, for instance, in like the, uh, in the exercise apps, like the, the watches and all the software that you can do to manage your life. Betterment's kind of the equivalent of that for your investing, okay. right? We, we take your, your investments and your future and, and, and use uh, all the information that you give us in terms of your behavior over time to help you make better decisions. Now, give me some numbers here. How has this grown? Can you give me any users? So last time we talked uh, in, in New York, uh, we had, uh, I think, just grown to about 40 million. Uh, in, in the last few months, we've, we've just crossed over 100 million. So we're growing like crazy. We're 100 million users. 100 million dollars Down under management. Oh, $100 million <laughs> under management. $100 million I'm like, under $100 million users would be a lot of users. Okay. <laughs> so $100 million under management. That's right. And that's a huge, that's a huge milestone. Um, and, uh, and we're growing at about 20% a month. So it's really exciting. And now differentiate this a little bit because in the past you know, couple of years since you guys arrived on the scene, we've seen a bunch of financial apps coming out trying to help people understand their finances. What, what is so Betterment? The key to, to Betterment is it's, uh, we think of it like Apple thinks of computers. It's both the hardware and the software. We don't just give you advice like a lot of uh, financial advisors and financial apps. And we're not just a broker like an E-Trade or, or uh, a Vanguard. We actually do everything all in one. We give you the advice and the execution in one package. And that lets us do things that nobody else can do. We can rebalance you and reinvest your dividends in a very tax efficient way. That's incredibly powerful. We also have all your data on our site. And so we can use that to then inform our recommendations to you. I see. And so we've got the new year here. We're about a year into the new year. You think resolutions. And when you talk about goal-based, you know, financial saving, totally. This what time kind of, of things year, are you seeing? This time of year, everybody's thinking about investing. They all know that they should be contributing to IRAs. So that's like the top of everybody's mind. Everyone puts it off. And one of the things that we've done at Betterment is we've reduced that barrier to entry so low that a lot of people who've never done it before are able to do it. The sign up is so quick. It connects right to your bank account. There's no risk really for trying it. So. Uh, so a lot of people are, are setting up IRAs with Betterment this time. So IRAs, are, that's not so much fun though. Are there any fun <laughs> projects? We're here in Vegas. Well, I, IRAs, I mean, we, we do make it kind of fun. Uh, the way that you can visualize it, the way that you can, uh, uh, people say the user experience is what really sets Betterment apart uh, from, from, from anybody else that's out there. Um, and that, uh, that, that makes it enjoyable to actually manage your money. And what's the typical user that you're seeing? Are there any demographics? So it's professionals. It's people who are doctors, lawyers, entrepreneurs, engineers. Um, we see that uh, uh, you know, our, our sort of sweet spot customer is um, uh, come to a point in life where they're already investing at Schwab or at E-Trade. They know that they, um, uh, are, are do they, they know what they're doing and they know um, uh, that it's important to invest, but they're not sure if maybe they couldn't be doing a little bit better. And so they sort of do a survey. They definitely don't want to pay 1% for an investment advisor. They see us, we're a tenth of that cost, and so they sign up with Betterment. Okay. And um, tell me about your team. Tell me about the company. So again, I think last time we talked, we were probably about 15 people. We've now doubled. We're 30 people. We're continuing to grow as fast as we can. We're really hiring developers um, uh, to, to build out the product and build out this vision for behaviorally focused, goal-based investing. 
And you just hired, when you talk about behaviorally focused, I understand yes. just this week you guys brought on a big wig in this space. We did. So from Barclays, we hired Dan Egan, who was the head behavioral economist over there. Uh, he's now heading up our behavioral economics team uh, and helping us learn from all this data that we have to give our customers more insight. So for instance, if you're, uh, if you're trading, if you're sort of moving more into stocks because you see that the market is up, we look at your past behavior and we'll tell you whether that's a good decision for you or not based on what you've done. Uh, and so we can actually help you at least match the market performance, if not do a little bit better than you have in the past. And now we're talking about all your users' personal goals. What are your personal goals or Betterment's personal goals, say for the next year? What are you really looking forward to here? What's your next? We expect to continue to grow as fast as we have. Uh, I think that uh, I think we'll have some amazing numbers by, by the end of next year. In the long term, we want this to be the way that uh, the, the kind of no-brainer way that everybody saves and invests for their for their goals. We look at ourselves kind of like the growth of ING Direct, uh, maybe in the last decade uh, that they came in and just took that online savings market with a really simple value proposition. Betterment is that for your investments. Well, saving always a good thing. I mean, we're here in Vegas, so maybe. Many of our savings will start next week after we get back home. But John Stein, thank you so much. Coming Thanks. by, talk to about be Betterment. Here.